Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. Today, I am going to show you on how to add custom faces to your Gorilla Tag Blender thumbnails. I am not going to show you much really, but before we get into the video, you are going to want to have these things. Okay, so the first thing you are going to want to have is you are going to want to have Nacho Engine's IK Rig. The second thing what you're going to want to need is you're going to want to need the custom faces which are in my discord server link in the description. And now the most important thing you're going to want to have blender. If you do not have any of these things go into the link in the description and you'll find everything you need. Okay so the first thing we want to do is we want to get the custom faces so you're going to want to open up google or whatever browser thing you have. Okay, so now once you are here, you're going to want to go into the link in the description. It is going to bring you to my Discord server. Once you are in my Discord server, you're going to want to scroll down a little bit until you see the downloads. And you're going to want to click on custom faces. Okay, so now once you are in here, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to left click on any of these faces. And once you finish left clicking, you're going to want to right click and you're going to want to save the image. Once you have the image save, you're going to want to open up Blender. Okay, so once you finish opening up Blender, you're going to want to go back to my Discord server and you're going to want to go to the downloads and select Nacho Engine's IK Rig. And you're going to want to go to this website and you're going to want to download the blend. Okay, so now once you finish downloading it, you're going to want to go back in Blender, click open, go to your downloads, and you're going to want to put in the Gorilla Tag IK Rig, the one you download. Once you open this, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on the mesh, not the rig. And once you finish clicking the mesh, you're going to want to make sure you're in object mode and go to shading. Once you are in shading, you're going to want to open up your file explorer. Once you finish opening up your file explorer, you're going to want to select on uh, this face or whatever one you downloaded. And you're going to want to drag and drop it into here. Once you drag and drop it to Blender, you're going to want to put this down click on this color hold make sure you're left clicking and holding it click on face and you can see nothing happened but you're going to want to click face texture change and you're going to want to put that up if it is blurry you, you want to make sure you have it on closest and you can see now it's all gone so you can see now we have the custom face in here so yeah and also if you want to change it back to normal you can go back to the shading tab and you can go like this so yeah Thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you want to you can like and subscribe but if you want me to make more tutorials like this comment down below tell me what tutorials to make for blender anyways see you later guys have an amazing rest of your day it's me squishy i'm out bye